I feel like I don't ever want to be that busy again. I don't ever want to be that busy. Like I got to a stage where I was just doing too much. I was doing too much, burning myself out. And I think we lose, it's very easy to like just lose sight of the goal. And like, we're so busy and so caught up. I was going to like, if I'm not going to Manchester, to Birmingham, to Bradford and to here, to there, then I'm flying to Australia, to South Africa. It's like I'm just burning myself out. I remember, I think it was February. I remember saying, I went from Milan, Paris, Dubai. I was just traveling nonstop. And I remember saying, I need a month off. I need a month of just doing nothing. I'm worn out. And then it's like, literally a few weeks later, they just started announcing the how it's from what was happening in China is now spreading across the world and stay indoors, stay home, stay safe. And I was like, look at that. And now we've been locked down for nearly a month. So for a month. So it's like I got my prayers basically were answered. So I don't I definitely don't want to go back to being busy. You know, like when you think about it, little things like like there's um in the Quran it says like the mutual rivalry of piling up wealth is what diverts you from the more serious things until you reach the grave. Then you should know. Like these things now you can ponder on it and say, wow, oh, man really was just in some rivalry of just piling up wealth. And even sometimes I feel like we get distracted, even like we're so business minded, mm. like need this company, that company, this business. And it's like sometimes we focus on it so much that we just lose sight of the goal. And really when these things happen, like we're locked inside, a lot of people are losing their mind and, ah, oh, what am I going to do? And, oh, my business and this is not working and that's not working. And a lot of people are stressed out and depressed. I remember saying the other day, you see, if we worked more on the inside and we focus more on the inside of us, like our hearts, our soul, like our spirit, then no matter what happens, whether we're in isolation, lockdown, even if we're told to stay inside, then we're still going to be at peace when we're inside because we found our inner peace from the inside. It wasn't from everything out there. It wasn't from the materials. It wasn't from the worldly gains. It wasn't from the business. It wasn't from that. Our peace and our happiness is from within. So no matter where we are, what we're going through, we still can maintain that same peace and happiness. So that's like, I made me think to myself, do you know what? That's what I need to work on, like... The in go back to the essence, the roots. Where like in Egypt, where it was just all about that inner peace inside. Definitely.